What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. The first time in a long time I'm deliberately reviewing a trash macro beer. This is the infamous Bud Light Lime, or BL Lime as it says in the back. Premium light beer with 100% natural lime flavor. 24 ounce can, 4.2% ABV. Made by Anheuser-Busch in St. Louis, Missouri. And it was only $1.47 at Walmart for all this beer. And you know, also for the first time ever, I'm using a, a frosted mug. I had this in the freezer for the last hour or something. So, what have we got here? I mean, we got a almost fluorescent yellow. I don't know if the, if the, I'm in the shade here, so I don't know if it really does it justice of just how brightly yellow this thing is. So, I mean, any, at, at the appearance, it looks just like any other macro lager or light lager. Bright white, sudsy head, it's fizzling away. <laughs> it actually smells more like soda or like Kool-Aid than it does beer, because all I smell is lime. So it smells very sweet and kind, it almost smells like sugary almost. Is it going to taste sugary? I don't know, we'll find out. Wow, between the, uh, <laughs> between putting it in the mug in the freezer and all that head and stuff, I actually tasted more water than beer. Um, let me top it off here, see if we can get a more accurate reading. In the Bud Light line. The head is just like all foam and soap, soap suds. And then I'm getting like, I'm getting the, the lime, Kool Aid, limeade, or whatever you want to call it. And then, like, way underneath it all is the actual Bud Light flavor. I mean, compared to the Chilada, regular Bud Light is delicious. So it's really, I mean, it's, it's tolerable. Um,. Yeah, this is... I didn't know it was going to be, like, this much lime. I thought it was going to be, like, Bud Light plus lime. But this is the opposite. This is lime plus Bud Light. Um, so it does kind of drink, like... Like I said with the aroma, is, uh... Like Kool-Aid. Like, it's just all lime all the time. This doesn't taste anything like when you suck Corona straight from the bottle with the, with the lime in the neck. It's just kind of... Alcoholic limeade. I mean, this is the kind of beer that it almost like demands to have like chips and salsa with it or any kind of finger food or something something salty um, as a summer refresher as you can probably tell I mean I, I guess it's doing the job it's it is it's thirst quenching by the fact that it's so damn watery and it tastes like more like Kool-Aid than, than even crappy Bud Light I mean, that lime flavor is all right, but, um, I don't know, I mean, I think to really enjoy this beer, you have to be, like, a big, huge fan of lime-tasting beverages, and, you know, I'm not. Um, I don't know, I guess there, there isn't much else to say about it. I mean, it's not horrible. I mean, the, the, the Bud Light Enchilada or Budweiser Enchilada is, like, way down here. This is kind of, like up here I guess um, it's tolerable it's uh, it's not like making me gag or anything like that um, but I would I would never you know seek this out it's you know just not to my taste I would take this over the regular Bud Light because it actually has flavor to it even though it's you know totally artificial but that being said um, I'm going to give a 3 out of 10 for the Bud Light Lime. It's it's tolerable. Alright, well I guess that about wraps it up for this episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. Again, that was a 3 out of 10 for the Bud Light Lime. Thanks for watching this episode, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.